just those few words and you'll get uh, uh, newspaper articles with their names. Would it not be prudent for this council, who have sought the advice of uh, our MPs, etc., to perhaps seek the advice of those lords to find out why they actually need chat 61 of uh, the Magna Carta and whether they feel we have a duty as uh, a town council or as representatives of people to join them in whatever action they're taking. Can I just state that the fact is, and you think of the information, that Article 61 has been invoked. It was invoked on the 23rd of March 2001. You've been given that information, because under the English British Constitution, everybody has the duty to stand under that article. If you don't do so, then you'll be sorry, but I think you're finished now. Well, just the public are going to know why you don't stand. Well, I think Councillor Cousins and, and his council will get together and we can discuss what he does. You have acquiesced every time I've asked you where you stand, sir. Well, please, I, I told you I'm not here to discuss that with you. If you want to discuss it with somebody, you should discuss it with people. You're a public servant. You're a to stand on the Be very careful, be very careful what you're saying. You're not saying to you, sir. Anything quiet, please. What I'm saying to you, sir, is that if you address, if you, if you can talk to the right people, we're not the right people. Well, you also have a duty to stand up to the Constitution. We haven't got a Constitution. We have a Constitution. You have this government propaganda, sir. What do you think the Bill of Rights is? The Declaration of Rights? Magna Carta? Yeah, someone needs to do some research. You're being Look, can we have some control here? Yes. We've had these meetings. I'm sorry, so we've had these meetings. The Councillor Tuzzy's office is talked about, and some of the other guys here may want to be involved in that. That's as far as we're going. You have a duty to stand in the Constitution, sir. Please take it down. No, and, 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 you know, you have a duty to do that. I wish to carry on with the meeting. Okay. Yeah, I'll be doing that. Oh, we haven't even started yet. Um, I would like to yeah. reiterate that I have asked for a meeting, so something will be done. We will to discuss the it's trade agreement. Yeah, that's and that's, not, a, that's, 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 that's not about the meeting. Following on from that, can you please sit down? Let and everyone let understand finish. exactly yeah. what it is that we are concerned about. Yeah, well, it's not Hopefully, about these councils will become so concerned about that that we then move forward have the discussion about Agenda 21 well, with the barons that we will invite. You are missing Article 61 every time when you speak. I'm talking about Article 61, lawful rebellion. You're talking about three party propaganda you're trying to pull on it. Let me down, let me down. No, just spoke for 20 minutes on his sample. Oh, goodness. <laughs> Council has made the point that four lords have decided to take part in the rebellion or something else. There's some six hundred. You've been given the information, Council. Some of lords, I believe, and if there's four of them, then it's not much of a position that they're taking. And if they feel that strongly about it, they're entitled to it. If you feel that strongly about it, you're entitled to it. We may not, I personally may not feel the same way as you, I'm entitled to that. It's a democracy where we all... You have a duty to stand under democracy. Under the Constitution, I no sir. Duty. I have no duty to, no. to try and reason as what I see the process how and make a judgment. Char chapter 61, the protocol says they follow the protocol exactly. No. Barons. Yeah. Yeah. We're moving on to Mary now, so it's okay. I have no idea. Not big, Dave. I don't know you're getting this. Yeah, the phone just went funny. Quiet, we're, moving to, we're moving on to the mayor's announcement. It is shameful. Quiz me. It should be a shame of your conscience. Public service. I have a couple of copies from Councillor Andrews, which I've lost since then. Since then.
give them a piece of it, but I've actually bothered to read it, and they no, actually really know what's going on. What, what, what I would advise is that the next election mm. run to be in the council, so I think that's a different view of understanding. So young people may be in the council. Um, absolutely, but maybe you know, a council full of local regulations. Yeah, yeah, because stop talking about fucking parking spaces. On <coughs> <coughs> Do you know, you know, it's like there's so many issues that really need to be sorted. We're wasting two hours and we've got fucking emblems on things. You know, it's just completely crazy. Well, the, the, um, I apologize for the emblem, that's my uh, issue. Parking is an equal opportunities issue, which I, you know, the emblem is, is, isn't really an issue. Anyway, um, yeah, but you know, you know what I'm saying, it's like the, this should have been the, the primary thing to talk about today. And even ask the councillors, if you're not quite, if you don't quite understand what we're talking about, if you're not quite aware of what's going on, we're going to give you another leaflet with all the stuff to watch, all the stuff to get offensive with. The mayor closed the conversation down, didn't he? Yeah, and also they should be aware that they said that we were in the Telegraph a couple of days ago, there is a, a, someone in Parliament, I can't remember who, who's actually, it's quite ridiculous way of saying saying it, but basically he's prepared, he's considering, revealing, um, quite a lot of names of pedophiles within Parliament, considering, it shouldn't be considered, it should just be done, but that's just proving my point that it, it is, it's actually now a fact that this government is fucking full of pedophiles. So, you know, people that work for the government should be aware of that, because why would you want to work for, for, for the mafia, dealing with drugs on, 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 on kids on the market? I mean, that's just completely... They're, they're, they're criminals, they're just, they're, they're just like an organised crime. The government is an organised crime. I think it's John. And they're, they're the best place to do it because who's going who's gonna to say anything? They've got the army. Now, right? But we've got to challenge that because this is not a fucking joke. It's, it's coming, you know? But they, they really have to be aware of it. I think it's completely ridiculous, you know? But the, thing, if, uh, the one thing I was going to say tonight, unfortunately I didn't have the chance to say it, but what I was going to say is like, you know, if you think it can be bought, you know, with money for bribery, or keeping your match up for fracking or for, for anything, you know, that they might give you money to, so that you can have a comfortable life or give a shit for anyone else. What they need to realise is that their conscience is going to follow them wherever they go, and one day it's going to slap them in the fucking face. And I'm sure they already know that. They need to be told that. Because nobody should be higher than anyone else. The, the head of the fucking queen should, should be removed for a start. From there. It's going to be support that. So there we are. At least I've got the full, full achievement of the World Coat of Arms removed from our coat of arms. Oh, thank God, that's one thing, yeah. Which is part of the. the <laughs> uh, I anyway. Mean, yeah. But I know what I'm saying is that there's so many things that we need to, that needs to be sorted on this. It's not even a joke, you know. I mean, half of them, like, you know, they're probably half wits. And it was only you that actually, as far as I could see, actually bothered to. Getting to talk about that. Lord on the Queen Councillor Michelle as well. Oh, cool. She's she's quite on it with Tink at least. And uh, to actually say we've got no constitution. I mean, oh yeah. my goodness. Yeah. Yeah. I did correct him in the end. I know you did. Well, there's some British constitution. Oh, that's me. 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 Oh, that's me.
I tried to actually study this today. Didn't even manage to write one line there. I split it with my girlfriend and had to get on my shit out of my way to talk to me now. So I came here, no preparation, nothing, it was like, just had to talk straight from the heart. No, you had me in tears there. Really? Yeah, it's, it's, yeah, well, we're, all, we're all there, aren't we? We're all there with you. We're all frustrated, no one's listening. All this worshipness. Yeah. What's it called? Your worship? Your worship? Oh, and then to turn around and say, well, I can't do anything? Yeah. Why are you called your worship yeah, then? Exactly, you're there to do something. The mayor, for goodness sake. I wish, I wish we could, you know. Oh, I know, the mayor who says there's no constitution yeah. is really shouting out treason. Yeah, yeah. Treason! <laughs> <laughs> Somebody uh, said so around the yeah, Act of Parliament took us into Europe. An Act of Parliament can take us out of the treaty. We yeah, said that's that. all. We, so that's all it takes. Yeah. And one, one, one actual uh, claim, a proven claim of treason would take, would knock out all the gifts, all the, all the treaties. Uh, the government are right. They say that treason is an unproven claim. But they won't give me my name call. They won't. For, they, for two well, years. Know why well, exactly. Because yeah. I can prove the claim. And this is where I'm at, I'm at my wit's end because there's nowhere else I can go but go to the people, which is what I've done in Basketball. And now Come taking on the local council, it's the only thing that, we, that is open to us. Because we were meant to look after us. Nicholson's ignoring all the things. It's not for government. Of course, I'm going to do it. It's for the public to be notified instead of being able to see all the time. Yeah. Nobody knows what's happening, nobody knows about these thoughts. Or that say 98% of the people on the street are talking about what's going on. Some of them have glasses. He talked to loads of people about this sort of shit. Certainly, there's the journalist was here from the paper. One time to the paper, and there'll be stuff in an article in the paper, right? The papers have been held up and bringing the truth. They've all given D notices. What do you think the general sense <coughs> Well, if you have a look, uh, if you have a look what's happened in the past, there was an article in uh, one of the papers, I think it could be in Guardian or something like that, and it was where one of the reporters was saying, is this becoming a police state? And they got a cartoon underneath them, grabbing Philippe Coppa, uh, big fat belly, big brown jewel sort of thing, holding this little sort of uh, uh, press guy. Up in the air, and it says it's just becoming a police state when the press cannot report what's happening and being threatened by arrest from our police. So, what, what you don't get on? a job, you don't get yeah. to work for all so the people. So, as I say, you've got no. press people that are saying, <coughs> 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 we're threatened by the police, and we will be yeah. arrested. You've got the same thing you want to say, otherwise, yeah. yeah. you don't it's work as a journalist. We're not going to all rest with an alternative. Personally, I think that all corporations should be made unlawful for stop. Yeah, yeah, we do. Anyway, guys, I'm, I'm yeah. going to. So, like the next thing is going to be the National Health Service is going to end up privatising. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, yeah. I was so really touched by your. Yeah, thank you. Well, I went to actually write all this down and stuff today, but I didn't. Oh.
So it will change, it changes, just means some people stand up while you're yeah. standing up. Yeah. So I could have an agent to the screen, but it does to do the shape, just to become an easy left on that from being within and I can say, look, this fucking bitch needs to be removed, right? Like right now. You, well, know? That, you could do that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> have a lovely rest of your evening. Yeah. Thank you. Good night, John. Bye bye, John. Oh, that was a bold statement. Oh, that was a bold statement. And just when you lovely boys are here. I've brought the thing with me. Yeah, well, basically, what uh, it's, it's a bilateral uh, treaty that's been uh, going on between America and Europe. Now, the thing is with this treaty, it protects the investors. Right, the investors come first. What's happened in Canada is because uh, Canada has turned down the fracking over there. The yeah. fracking companies have now sued the Canadian government for not having fracking. And yeah. oh, we know what fracking does. Yeah. Now, in Germany, the Germans actually turned down uh, nuclear power. 
um, because of the Fukushima disaster. Mm -hmm. yes. So now they're being sued um, <coughs> under the street and everything else. It's where governments get sued, massive amounts. We come out of that public first. Yeah. And this is what the corporation yeah, is. Now the thing is, at this minute, right, it's not going ahead until November the 1st it goes in fully. Totally. Exactly the same as it's coming under Europe. Yeah. Unless we get people to understand what is happening in this country so they can turn around and say, well, we don't agree with this because this is going to privatise our national health and everything else. It's going to make it so that all the corporations are going to be absolutely beyond the law, untouchable. Yeah. And it means that basically you guys aren't going to be able to do your job as a policeman yeah, on the street. Yeah, you're not going to be able to do your job as a policeman on the street. Oh, excuse me a second, one at a time. European law, right, is actually a habeas corpus, right? Which means you are guilty until proven. No, that's not true. It's coming as true as you're sorry. Yeah, I'll get it right. I'm Latin, not the. It's a lot to remember. It is a lot to remember. But basically, you're, you're guilty until proven innocent in the European Court. Right. You know, so in this country, we have your own innocent until yeah. proven guilty. We don't want to lose that in our constitution. We don't want to be sold out to a foreign country. What so, what happened in 2001? There was a treaty of Nice, uh, sorry, the treaty of Nice went ahead in 2000. 2001, the barons themselves, right, who, if you remember writing the Magna Carta and everything else, right, the, the barons actually told him that he would be found out unless he actually had bargained by these rules and all our coronations and everything and all our kings and queens in this country are about to go down this line and about to, about to swear allegiance to this. Now the thing is, is anybody who stands against this seeing the barons of the 14 Article 61, right, is committing treason. And our queen herself, by what she's doing, is actually committing grand treason yeah. against her people, which she swear swore on her coronation mm -hmm. oath to serve us as a people. Yeah, well, she preached many, many yeah. times. She she's did. not the queen anymore. And she's actually the master of treason. She's been de 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 uh, de uh, regulated as, the, um, as a citizen of Europe. What, what I'll do, because you're firing so many yeah, no, so 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 yeah. to try and remember what that's going to be yeah. uh, off of it. If you want to just take a quick look at Magna um, <laughs> Carta, you want to take a quick look at Article 61. We've, we've got other really officers coming over who are much more senior than we are. Oh, brilliant. Um, we were there the ones, so yeah. Yeah, yeah, brilliant. we were sent over to see you know, what your expectations are as to why you're here how you're going to leave or if you're going to leave. Um, well, we'd like to get this to the British public. So we, the British we public can see what's happening. Yeah. Sure, it's about to be the standard. We've tried everything, every avenue we've tried. We've been run by a corrupt crown, corrupt criminal government, you know, which are pedophiles, most of them anyway, under their being protected from the British public. And they've been running around with all these people that are not there, and they're not there, 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 yeah, for a start. It's certainly already not. Yeah, yeah, it's it's already it's 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 what we do from this point is, is yeah. uh, uh, it could be a matter of diplomacy. Um, I mean, lawfully, you can't evict us from your building um, because we've been breaching constitutional law. And it's also our building. It's a public thing. Thanks for allowing us in your building. It never looks worse, doesn't it? It looks like a tiny But, I mean, <coughs> We could leave under duress, but we're not, you know, we're, we're, we're not just going to give up on this. We, we've tried, I've tried to lobby the police. This isn't going to get out of hand until we're making it. No, 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 I mean, I'm here, I'm kind of witnessing. Because you can say this is the same way. We're grown-ish. We're not going to say this. And the girls aren't going to be, well, it might be a threat to you, but don't think so. Just a secret ninja at the back. No. She's about to pull one of the things. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
So I'm not intending to seize the building. You've done that. Well, we're doing that. Basically, we seize the building. Yeah. And we're deciding that we're going to stay there until we can get this public. Well, maybe we've been we're 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 and you guys from Sacred Wacken Supply, or even into the building. As long as it needs to be until we manage to get the TV, there'll be a waste of time. Second? As a thing is, they may not bring the TV or whatever, they can't be in the city area. Well, we're at the end of the day, we can get the media to come down here and talk to us about this, and we can also get Tricia Tessa to come down here and talk to us about this. Well, Tessa won't come down here. This is what the town council have asked her to come down and talk, talk about the yeah. and the Lisbon Treaty, she won't come down. Okay. Neither so have any you contact the media to come here? Um, yes. We, we didn't have to do that. We have before. The media was on it earlier. No way. That was the Guardian, wasn't it? Yeah. <laughs> um, we got it all on video, so it's going viral on the internet anyway. Okay, so and you can put that on the internet and yeah. stay here for the rest of the night? Well, we, we could too, but... Um, you know, this is a matter of... Uh, if we all go home, it's all going to get forgotten about. Yeah. The first November comes, you're going to get taken over, so right? Um, by the European uh, police. They're going to be telling you what to do on our streets. Mm -hmm. That's that's not on my okay. We haven't lost this country through... No, no, no. no, 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 no what I'm saying is we haven't um, lost this country through... Okay, like like on the other day,
Glastonbury tonight, and the police have been called and they've um, decided that we're not committing any criminal offence, and um, so they've left. Now we have a moral obligation here 
Um, because what we're doing is we're causing the caretaker a lot of harm by he, he wants to go to his to his wife and his dinner, and um, so we're, we've got a bit of dilemma. We could we could stay here, we seize the building, or we could leave under duress um, to to save breaching the common law and causing this guy unnecessary loss or harm. So we're in debate about this. We're going to talk to the um, to the caretaker in a minute and. Uh, Hopefully up here, so you'll get to see what's going on. Yeah. 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 We always get the press on this. Yeah. 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 Well, I, I was thinking we should get the new now. Yeah. Yeah.